Well, the hunt for a man who has been hiding in the woods, armed with a sawed-off shotgun and pistol, continues. A man called our newsroom this morning claiming to be the suspect officials are looking for right now. The man said officials have it all wrong. The manhunt is underway in Gis. The city is located about 11 miles south of Buna. 12 News reporter Jordan James is following this. You talked to the man on the phone this morning, right? Yes, I spoke with him and he had a lot to say. This manhunt has left the community on edge and deputies wondering when it will be over. We're just trying to find the guy and try to get him some help. A plea to stop running from Newton County Sheriff Billy Rolls as day two of the search for a suspect continues. We pull out and he'll go to some house to get some help and uh, he was barefooted for a while, and then now he's, somebody's giving him some boots. Sheriff Rolls says a dispute at a home in Newton County Sunday prompted family members to call police. When they arrived, the suspect, who has not been named, took off into the woods and has threatened to harm himself along with officers. A mental health warrant has been issued for his arrest. Hopefully we can get him without somebody getting hurt. Deputies believe that the suspect is still in the woods in Giss, which is about 11 miles away from Buna, north of Mauriceville. A man called our station claiming to be the suspect at the center of the manhunt. Oh yeah, I'm safe. I'm in swimming trunks out in the woods and we're going to have 30 degree weather tonight. The man says he wants to clear his name and believes he's not a threat. All that what they're talking about on the news, it ain't nothing like that. I'm not a danger to anybody. Multiple agencies across Southeast Texas are assisting with the search, hoping for a quick and peaceful ending. The people here know him. If they see him, give us a call. Call 911. He wants us to hurt him, and, and uh, that's the last thing we want to do. Again, the man is still on the run and has not been caught. Newton County Sheriff deputies say if you see anything suspicious in the Gist area, be sure to contact them. Reporting here in Jefferson County, Jordan James, 12 News. Thank you so much, Jordan.